Hey guys, it's Kugi again with another ROM review and this time I've got Snapdragon S3 V3 ROM for Galaxy S3. Okay, now uh, what is this ROM? This is a stock based ROM based on the Samsung's latest uh, official release of Android that is 4.3 and I have to say this, this is an awesome ROM. I've used it for a few t a few days, I guess uh, one and a half day, and it is pretty fast. This is now based, well, the other 4.3 ROMs are based on the XX UGMJ9 version, which was the initial release of, uh, I guess, in UK and Ireland. This one, the developer claims that this is based on the Chinese release of 4.3, so it has uh, a lot of bug fixes the Samsung the Samsung guys have fixed a lot of bugs you can see the uh, animations the uh, ripple animation was locked smoother it was pretty good I guess it did uh, it does uh, seem a lot faster than the 4.3 version in UK and Ireland so uh, again about the ROM again let's go to about phone page it still displays this one i guess he um, they, uh, didn't quite change the uh, build dot prop tweaks so it does it still uh, displays this one this one is based on as the chinese version is uh, i guess i always forget the name of it it is z c b u m k2 it, well it is mk2 version so um that is it that is the uh, fastest release i guess it is the best bet to go for 4.3 if you want stock goodies so what else does this rom offer okay first of all the smoothness is unparalleled i have i just flash this again so as to give you guys first hand experience out of the box it is the fastest uh, rom okay uh, the other ROMs after uh, I have I have tried a few apps installing a few apps like uh, five or fifteen apps and still it uh, it does deteriorate a bit but not to a point that it's unusable like in the other ROMs that's why I'm not using this as my uh, uh, daily driver but this one does make quite an effort okay first of all this one has uh, the kernel used in this is the devil kernel I'll show you guys. It does come with uh, Devil Tools. I guess this is a, a obsolete version of the Devil Tools. You have to update this. Um, it has all these functionality. You can see go through them. You have toggle theme. Yes, you ha you can change the theme of this one. Uh, you have a lo lot of options here. Uh, kind of similar to S tweaks and uh, Biofilla kernel tweaks. So yes you do have a lot of options uh, I have not personally used devil devil kernel on any of my previous ROMs so I'm not entirely sure how stable or how much does the 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 performance increase but this does seem a lot smoother than the other ROMs now uh, let's go to settings what are this this is kind of like a note 3 themed uh, it's funny because uh, the initial versions of Snapdragon S3, uh, the V1 and V2, uh, went a lot, went through a lot of scrutiny uh, because it, it, I guess it was uh, based on the S4 Revolution ROMs, the initial versions, of course, and uh, he didn't give proper credits. The developer, I guess, it is iPro Hackers, uh, he didn't give proper credits and uh, that kind of stuff, and the ROM was banned once. And then in V3, which is this one, uh, I guess he changed a lot of things. Uh, apps has been changed, and uh, I guess now it's all okay. Um, yeah, that's a bit of a history about this ROM. Uh, that's why I couldn't uh, review the ROM earlier. Uh, it was still based on MK2 at that time also. Now, I hear a few talks about uh, the Samsung releasing its new firmware, new... Um, updated fixed firmware to UK but I don't know when it will be able to, will be able to use it so uh, it doesn't come with an aroma installer so you can't select the kernel or something it, it you have to select the devil kernel and in turn you can change the kernel uh, it does have no 3 launcher which is identifiable from the horizontal line page indicator it does have my magazine 
which is this one I haven't configured it so I will not be configuring it now now uh, I did have a bit of a restart issue with the camera when I, when uh, I at first when I used the camcorder I did have a restart but then it just fixed itself so I don't see it as a huge problem it does come with the uh, N5 camera and gallery app so you will be covered in that location so if you are skeptical about using the Samsung camera what else do we have it does, it has all the Samsung apps it is note 3 styled you have my files which is note 3 styled you have calculator which is note 3 styled it, you, you do have s voice s translator and s health i guess from the s4 line and uh, all these apps also super sue voice recorder setting etc etc you have a lot of uh, the stock apps but where if you might consider that I consider this as extra bonus features so you have all that also uh, let's go to settings something which I um, found to be interesting uh, safety assistance I I guess it is available in a lot of other ROMs also but I found this one uh, pretty good um, just wanted to throw that out oh, and this one also has uh, the glare effect and the ink effect what you saw in that was the ink effect now you have the light effect also let's see light effect now I mostly use light effects and because uh, well, it's faster but with the 4.3 the ripple effect is also considerably faster than the um, previous version so I guess I might be using this you have ink effect also you can select the color of the ink it doesn't display the uh, preview so yeah I don't know what that is what else well, the other things are pretty much stock. You know about it. It's pretty good. It really works. It, uh, the stock ROM. Any idea of going with stock ROM is to have most stable version. And uh, well, the previous 4.3 versions, it was not stable enough. So yeah, it's not the best way to go. But with this one, it is. It uh, it really now has a chance against the other ROMs so yes i guess that much is it about the rom i'm not sure about the battery life though uh, i didn't get the best battery life out of this so uh, i'm not sure if samsung really have fixed it in china but they say they have fixed it in uk now with, with the latest version of their update so i will look into that if i get a chance of it uh, let me just restart and show you guys the boot animation and boot sound So here is the uh, S4, uh, S4 sounding boot animation. So yeah, it is nothing special. It's just a Samsung logo flashing. It just booted up. So uh, let me show you guys again. This is the ROM. Okay, one more thing. It does have aggression mod. So that makes this smoother. The aggression mod is like a lifesaver for those using this ROM the 4.3 stock based ROM it it requires that because it's just unusable in a uh, normal situation so yeah I guess that much is it with um, this ROM again this is Snapdragon S3 uh, hope you guys like the video please subscribe like and share the video if you found it useful see you guys next time bye